Can you tell me how astronauts poo and pee in space? And now, over to our science expert! I'm Iris. It's a known fact that astronauts can't cry the same in space as they do on your Earth. So with that information, it begs the question, how do they go to the toilet for a number ones and a number twos? In space, let's investigate. I'm in need of a screen. Thank you. Hello again. I'm hovering above the ISS space station where spacemen and spacewomen have just had their space breakfast and space cup of coffee and they're needing a space toilet break but because of the microgravity things behave differently in space over to the narrator for a better explanation Hello again, it's me, Professor Feltman, and they've got me on the ISS. When you go to the lavatory on Earth, gravity behaves with the rules. What goes up must come down. So that's what happens to your bodily fluids. But up here in space, the microgravity effect is more like what comes out must float around. Oh, it looks like someone's missed. So, here's how to avoid floating space turds. Number ones, that's urinating. Space people have a foothold to keep them in place. A funnel that catches the wee and sucks it into a storage container. If you have external bodily plumbing, like a spaceman, you have to place the funnel close enough to catch the wee, but not so close that you get sucked into the vacuum. Ooh. If you're a space woman, you put the funnel directly against your body. Your space wee is treated and recycled for consumption. Ah, lovely. And for number twos, that's a poo, you secure yourself over a small opening on the toilet with footholds. A flowing airstream in the toilet sucks the waste away just like a vacuum cleaner to stop any escaping poo floating around the space station. The waste sewage is held in a storage tank and freeze-dried, killing bacteria. This odor-free, non-toxic poo is sent out in a container and burns up in its re-entry to Earth's atmosphere. Here's some nice pictures of some space toilets. Going to the lavatory is easy when you're on a space station. But if you're on the moon, it's a different story. The moon's gravity is one-sixth of the Earth, so poo and pee will drop to the ground very slowly. Pretty hard, isn't it? That boat is gonna roll. Man, that is hard. <laughs> Just don't stub your toe. Whether you're on the moon or in deep space, gravity is of little use if your space suit is sealed. For there are no zips or flaps for you to get rid of your waste. So it's back to basics with adult-sized diapers, called Maximum Absorbent Garments, or MAGs for short. These high-tech diapers use super-absorbent fibers and can hold over a liter of liquid, and are suitable for both sexes.
If you've liked this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye.